Russell Fork Pharmacy is your locally owned pharmacy, offering fast, friendly service with competitive prices and free delivery. Call 606-754-7085. Visit russellforkpharmacy.com and download our free mobile app for refill requests and more. Hundreds of people in Letcher County got a hand up over the weekend to help them provide Christmas for their families. I visited a couple of outreach events on Saturday where Christmas may have been made a little brighter for a lot of families, thanks to the efforts of numerous volunteers. The Community Christmas Outreach in Jenkins and the Ignite Community Outreach in Letcher drew hundreds of people who were allowed to pick from clothes, coats, household items, toys, and numerous other items. The goal was to give a hand up to at-risk families and individuals who may have been struggling at Christmas time. The events, which relied solely upon donations, was, according to organizers and volunteers, a runaway success. We've had people coming in since about 7.50 this morning, and the first one had never owned his own bike, so him picking it out and getting to experience that, the smile on his face has just made my day for the rest of the day. These kids going around picking out what they want, it's, it's just really a blessing for us. This has been an amazing event, and overwhelmed in a good way. These people have come and poured out their love, our volunteers have, and then all the recipients have been so kind and loving, and it's just been a blessing. At Letcher, more than 100 bicycles were given to area kids thanks to a group of men in Georgia. Well, it's just a true blessing, you know, here at Christmas when Christ was born for these bikes to come and to be able to present them to these children and see their faces when they leave and go home with them. And um, it is a joy. Mr. Herman Miller started it when we started bringing bikes up about four or five years ago. And, and it, it just warms your heart to see them go out with the kids. It's one of many ministries that we do from Miller's store in uh, Henry County. And uh, Mr. Miller started this about 11 years ago and he brought some used bicycles. I think the first time he brought bicycles was only 12 bicycles. This time we have 102. But to see these children receive these bicycles and see the smiles on their face and to receive the, some of them are, are happier about the coats and the sock hats and the gloves and the socks they get than the bicycles. One of the little boys was just excited for anything, anything that he could get. And he was so, you could tell he was really thankful for what he was getting. Those benefiting from the event at Letcher, including a grandmother who has custody of her three grandchildren, were appreciative of the efforts of all of those who put the events together. Oh, it means a whole lot. I'm thankful for the blessings and without this, they probably would not have received the new bicycles. I could see the excitement in their face and I was really excited to see them happy and to be able to pick out things um, from this uh, Christmas blessing. Just uh, thank God and thank all the volunteers and all the people that donated and helping make Christmas possible for people that, you know, may not, may not have had it otherwise. Very appreciated. It's just a blessing. It really is. Um, I know that some of these kids probably wouldn't have a Christmas. I know that some of them just has a, a hard time. And watching them receive gifts that are, are free, they can just pick out, and there's no strings attached to it. And like some of them come in and they're like, I only want this one, and you're like, honey, you can have that. There's no limit because they only, they only want to pick one or they only want to get two. And when they realize that they can pick it out, it, it really is a blessing. In Jenkins, more than 600 people benefited from the community Christmas outreach, which included a toy land with piles of donated toys for all ages. Among those people, an out of work coal miner from the Jenkins area and a mother of four living on a fixed income. Dressed out, you know, and you know the kids, you know what I mean, you can't really tell them that, you know what I mean, you just, you just as a family we're stressed out, but you know, Santa Claus is coming, you know what I mean, he's coming. Is, is, this, is this kind of part of Santa Claus coming? This is, yeah, this is big time Santa Claus is coming right here, yes. Right now, I mean, this is, this is amazing, I love this. If we didn't have these giveaways for our kids, I sometimes wouldn't have clothes for them. Um, sometimes wouldn't have shoes for them. We're very fortunate to have these type of events here 
for me, myself, and my kids, and the people around us also who don't always have the money to buy for their kids or a lot of money to buy for their kids. Some of the items that I got was for Christmas presents to put with other toys that they have. They get to pick up their own toys, pick out what they want, what color they want. They get to choose how they want to play with it. And it's awesome seeing all these kids running around enjoying the Christmas spirit. Just for me, first off, being a part of Jenkins, you know, just the community and this right here, definitely for children, you know, when they, you see them smiling, running around, you know, having a great time, you know. And some of them, this is, a, you know, Christmas time. And I love it, you know, it's right here. It's awesome. Hygiene items, clothing, and coats all donated were also available and as one organizer says, met a need that may have otherwise gone overlooked. We've been told that they are just, that we've helped to make their Christmas less stressful and more fulfilling for their children. We're able to provide them with toys and hygiene items and things that they were in need of and it kind of takes the stress off the parents. And one of my favorites is when they leave here with their warm coats and they tell me how great it feels that they've got something warm on. We're just very grateful. We're grateful for everyone who's participated in this event and everyone who has um, come and helped and served and loved on people and for everyone who showed up. When it was all over, hundreds of people had received the blessings of the Christmas season. Merry Christmas! Including the volunteers who had helped make it all happen. I'm just blessed to be here. I mean, I mean, God could allow anyone to do this, but He chose us. So I'm just, I just love being here and helping. In Letcher County, Chris Anderson, Mountaintop News.